The U.S. Deputy Secretary of State, Kurt Campbell, has said that Washington will refer, uh, will prefer to recruit more STEM students from India and not China. This move comes amid growing security concerns in the U.S. and its efforts to limit Chinese nationals from accessing sensitive technology. Campbell also called India an important U.S. security partner. The Deputy Secretary said that the U.S. is looking to welcome Chinese students to study humanities rather than science. For years, China Chinese nationals have been the largest international student cohort in the U.S. This despite a decline in the number of students heading to Washington due to COVID limitations and strained bilateral relations. In the academic year 2023-24, 290,000 Chinese students were enlisted in U.S. universities as opposed to 270,000 Indian students. Experts claim that the security friction between Washington and Beijing has subjected Chinese students to unwarranted discrimination. In fact, under the Trump administration, the U.S. introduced the China Initiative. It focused on, quote, unquote, combating against Chinese espionage and intellectual property theft. The initiative was brought to an end over concerns of racial profiling of Asian Americans. This after Joe Biden was elected president. Campbell said that under the Biden administration, the U.S. universities made careful attempts to provide higher education to Chinese students while, be while being careful of sensitive places like labs and their activities of quote-unquote some Chinese students as well. Now, while the deputy secretary also added that the U.S. Uh, was being careful to not disturb ties with Beijing, and between the two, China is to be blamed for the fallout in academic, business or non-profit sector ties. Manufacturing that's going to dominate 21st century economies. That is seen as... For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.